you know, in my career as a silk moth breeder and entomologist, I have seen a lot of moths. I have bred many species of silk moth. So, despite that, this one still impresses me with its beautiful colors. Is the Agapema homogena, a small uh, silk moth from North America and Mexico and in parts of South America as well. As you can see it's beautiful. I believe the homogena comes from the Rocky Mountains. And what I'm filming right now are three females. It's not a very uh, big species actually, but it's still much bigger than I expected them to be, interestingly. So I'm just showing you their beauty. Really nice, they remind me, they remind me of Saturnia Emperor moths. And in a previous video I made a mistake. I said they eat oak, but that's wrong. They don't eat oak. One of their natural host plants seems to be Ramnus californica. I believe that's called coffee berry. And they're also reported on other random plants. I believe one of them was willow. But I think those are suboptimal host plants for them. And the best for them to use for breeding, in any case, is the coffee berry or maybe a European version of Ramnus or a native if you have Ramnus in your area or Ramnasea because some people breed them outside of their native habitat of course so you have to find something from the family of Ramnus and hopefully they'll eat it I had one female and three males a few days ago but strangely they refused to pair which kind of sucks and the males only lived for a few days and now all the females are emerging and now they are single and have no males. So yeah, that also kind of sucks. I really wanted to breed more of these. With some luck, maybe I'll have another male in a few days, I don't know. I had about 10 cocoons and I think I have about uh, two, two or three cocoons left. So I hope those hatch very soon and maybe I can pair uh, a few females. I would like to raise it. If I don't succeed in breeding it this year, I will try again next year, of course, because I'm stubborn like that. And I want to breed every species, as, uh, at least as many as possible, as long as I'm alive and well on this planet. So yeah, thank you for watching. I believe it comes from the Rocky Mountains, by the way, and then don't know if I already said that. Just a very nice species. Also very hyperactive and frantic, so handling them and taking pictures of them can be hard. Thank you for watching.